Alright, so today I have for you my October favorites, and I'm going to try to make this video as short as possible, and hopefully it won't be too long, but anyways, I'm um, getting right to the point. I'm just going to start off with what, whatever's in front of me, no particular order to this, but first thing I've been loving is this right here. It's my Urban Decay Naked Palette. Sorry if I keep looking off like this way, it's because the mirror is right here, and it's really distracting, but anyways. The Urban Decay Naked Palette is so versatile, um, great for bridal looks. Um, I have a Pretty Little Liars tutorial coming up here pretty soon using this palette. Quality is amazing. It comes with a great brush. It is a little pricey, but for the amount of money you pay, you really are getting a great product. So, I love that. The next thing that I've absolutely been loving is my MAC blush in Peachy Keen. It's just a shimmer blush. It's like a rose color with a little bit of a peach tone to it and some gold flecks in it. Very buildable, very appropriate for fall and winter. Um, works great with all skin tones, I find. And it just applies really nicely and it doesn't look heavy on the skin. Especially if you're wearing more foundation in the winter, you don't want to pile on a whole bunch of stuff. You just want a nice finish. So the next thing that I've been loving is my MAC lipstick. And this is in, what are you, Angel. It's just like a very peach color. Very nice, natural looking lipstick for an everyday wear. Um, so, been loving that. And I also love the way MAC lipsticks smell. They have like sort of a vanilla scent to them, so. Anyways, moving on. The next thing that I've been using is my Smashbox, what are you, Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. I have a lot of Smashbox products and none of them have been disappointing and this is no exception to that. It makes my foundation go on so much smoother. Um, I, I don't think it feels heavy at all. It actually feels pretty light going on the skin. It glides on very easily and it's easy to take off when you want it to. So great product. I absolutely love it. I use it every day. The next thing that I've absolutely been loving is my Hard Candy Glamouflage Concealer and I'm in the shade Light. This is very comparable to Kat Von D's stuff. Um, this stuff is an exceptional value first of all and it goes on so smooth it doesn't look cakey at all it's only seven bucks and for the amount of product you get I've been using this every day for two months and I have hardly made a dent in it it it's amazing I really do love this and for the price you really can't beat it alright so the next thing that I've been using a lot and loving is my Maybelline baby lips if I can get them all here I have all of them um, the finish that these give off is so I don't even know how to describe it there's never been anything that I've used that's been quite like these. They go on and they look almost like you have a lip gloss on, but you don't. It doesn't feel heavy or goopy or sticky or anything like a normal lip gloss would. Um, it applies just like a chapstick. The scent to them is very, very light. Um, I probably will be doing a separate review on these later on once I use them a little bit more, but highly recommend them. They come in different ranges of colors from a nude to a dark purple to pink to red, everything in between. Great, great, great product, um, and they're pretty cheap. They're like only $2.50 or something like that. Okay, so the next thing that I've absolutely been loving is my Leaves candle. Oh, it smells so good. Oh, it smells like apple cider. I actually went out and bought more because they are now switching to their winter scents, and I don't really like any of those, but oh, it smells so good. So I picked up, we have like four of them as backup candles. So got a couple of those, and I absolutely love them. Okay, so the next one is more like fashion related and it is my military inspired boots. I got these at Macy's for like 60 bucks. They just have a zipper up the side and they're so cute with like a pair of skinny jeans. And even like with what I'm wearing right now, like this plaid shirt. These are like an olive green. I don't know how you're going to be able to see these. But they're like an olive green tone and they're just like the combat boot inspired with a little bit of a heel. Not too much. They lace all the way up. They're super comfortable. Um, the inside is actually, I don't know if I can show you this. The inside is actually like a, almost like a felt line. So they're really warm. Um, and they, they're pretty flexible actually. For them having such like a hard sole, they're actually really comfortable to walk in. Took me a little bit to get used to, but um, I was in the military for three years, so I have worn my share of combat boots. But they're really comfortable and I highly recommend you get these as like a staple piece in your wallet because the military trend is always coming back. So anyways, alright so that was my favorites for this month. I hope you guys all enjoyed it and I will hopefully be getting a Pretty Little Liars tutorial up here soon for you guys. So thanks for watching. Bye.